Hello guys, welcome back to Mufasu Cat with AutoCAD 3D Modeling Protect Exercise number 52 How to make a 3D wooden chair Okay, we start now, open your AutoCAD software And first I will change into right view, you can click here And change into right Okay, next uh, we correct line, start uh, from this point to the right uh, 7 And I will uh, move her to the top here 100 Okay you can use uh, rotate command to rotate uh, this line object start from this point with uh, angle uh, 13 and then you can uh, copy this uh, object start from this point to this point next uh, I will uh, create a line object start from this point to the left here x9 and you can use a mirror command to mirror uh, these uh, three objects start from middle point here to the bottom and enter you can uh, move uh, this uh, line object uh, to the top 57 okay and then uh, I will uh, copy this uh, object uh, to the top uh, 7 next uh, you can uh, rotate this uh, two lens object start from this point with uh, angle uh, minus uh, 3 and enter to finish okay use uh, trim command to cut uh, in here and then so I will cut uh, in here okay I will delete uh, this uh, object and you can create line start from this point into here okay with uh, this 10 and 90 and i will select uh, this line object uh, delete you can uh, copy this uh, line object uh, to the top uh, 7 and enter now i will correct line start uh, from uh, this point to the top and you can use uh, trim command to cut uh, in here okay i will cut uh, in here and then I will cut uh, in here okay you can create a line object uh, start up from this point to the left here and move uh, the last object uh, to the top uh, 29 okay 29 and I will create line start up from this point to the top in here next uh, you can uh, rotate this uh, line object start from this point with the uh, angle minus uh, 18 and enter okay just uh, copy command to copy this uh, line object to left here 7 and then so you can move uh, this line object to the top uh, 62 enter and then I will uh, trim use uh, extend option I will extend in here and I will cut uh, in here okay next I will cut uh, in here I will select uh, this line object and delete okay this uh, trim command again I will cut uh, this line object and enter next uh, I will use uh, UGS command you can tap uh, UGS and then select cut this point to this point and move into this point we create a line object start from this point to here and then so I will trim uh, with extend option in here okay next you can copy this uh, line object uh, to the bottom here 7 and enter okay Next, uh, I will create line start uh, from this point to the bottom uh, 17, move uh, to this point uh, 5, move to this point uh, 17, and close. You can use uh, join command to join uh, this uh, all object, and we copy this uh, object to this point uh, 21, okay, and then to this point 21, and enter. Okay, next uh, you can move uh, this object start from this point to this uh, point okay I will change uh, UGS again you can tap a uh, UGS command and select at uh, this point to here and move uh, to the top 
we create a line object uh, to the bottom here uh, 5 and to this point uh, 17 move uh, to the top of uh, 5 and then close now you can join this uh, object okay next uh, I will uh, copy this uh, object to the left here uh, 21 okay and then I will copy again this object uh, to the left uh, 21 the last we copy again 21 and then enter okay now I will uh, extend okay in here and you can uh, move uh, this object start from this point into this uh, point and then we move uh, this object to this uh, direction at uh, 13 and enter use uh, trim command again to cut uh, in here okay we already create uh, this uh, simple object okay next uh, I will uh, join uh, this object you can select uh, this object okay and I will select uh, in here you can press uh, enter to join okay we already join you can change into right view again you can click here right view and next uh, I will uh, copy this uh, object okay into this uh, point we create line start from this point to here move to the top okay I will uh, create line in here okay and then so i will use a trim command to cut uh, in here okay we cut uh, in here you can select uh, this object and then delete okay next i uh, use a uh, join command to join uh, this uh, all object i will move uh, this uh, object start from this point to this uh, point okay Next, uh, I will convert uh, this uh, to this cat into 3D models. You can use uh, extrude command to extrude uh, this object into this uh, direction uh, 7. Okay, next uh, I will copy this object into Z direction about uh, 80 and enter. Next, uh, you can uh, extrude this uh, object. Okay, you can select uh, this object. Extrude into here. And then you can use a union to combine uh, this object. Okay, and enter. The last, uh, I will uh, extrude uh, this object. Okay, a rectangle. This is a rectangle object can select here enter and then move to this point okay change into left view I will change into left view and we create a circle in here with uh, radius uh, 2 and we create circle in here with the radius uh, 2 okay next you can use uh, UGS command I will create a UGS in here and move uh, this uh, circle object uh, to the top here uh, 16 okay I will use a uh, UGS again and then create uh, in here UGS and move uh, the circle object uh, to the top uh, 16 okay change into top view and then so we will extrude uh, this uh, object circle object you can type uh, extrude command select uh, this uh, to circle and move to this point use a union command to combine uh, this uh, circle uh, cylinder object into one okay we already create uh, this uh, 3d models you can change into realistic to view this object okay now I will uh, try to give material and rendering this object you can change into top view and I will change into the wireframe. We create a plan soft. Ok, 
okay start up from uh, this point to this point and we create a camera start up from this point to this point okay change into left view i will move uh, this uh, chair to the bottom here okay next uh, you can change into camera one view okay i will press uh, f7 to hide the grid and then you can change into realistic view okay i will give a material into this uh, object you can tap r mat to open a material browser i will use a wood material you can click here wood and i will apply uh, this material into this object you can select uh, this object okay right click and assign to selection for uh, this uh, object i will use uh, this uh, material which right click and assign to selection you can uh, close and then so we will try to rendering uh, this uh, object okay you can active uh, full shadow click here full shadow and use a uh, high render okay this for example i will use high render and active uh, environment you can click here active environment use background as usual i will use uh, solid with uh, white uh, color okay and you can click ok ok close now i will try to rendering this object you can click here to render waiting for initializing and we waiting for our renderings until finish it's about 10 level okay we already finished the rendering process and i think it's enough today for autocad 3d modeling practice exercise number 51 how to make a 3d wooden chair if you have any question about this uh, tutorial you can comment below this video and see you next time in another autocad 3d modeling practice exercise number 53